Hi guys, welcome to I Hate Math Group. In this video, we're gonna learn how to simplify rational expressions. So let's do it. So let's say that you have something like this, three over x plus two plus four over x plus three. Well, this is very easy. Remember, when you have a fraction that have different denominators, the trick is to have or make it the same denominator. For example, when you're adding a fraction, and let's say that you have three over five plus, uh, let's just put one half, well, I cannot add this fraction unless both denominators are the same. So what I'm gonna do is a little bit of magic. So I'm gonna multiply this guy by two on the bottom and here by the top by two as well, but here I can do it by five. And whatever I do to the bottom has to be done to the top. Basically what I'm doing is just rewriting each expression. What happens? I can do whatever I want as long as I, I do it to both sides. Think about it, two divided by two is just one. So I'm basically just rewriting this. Once I have the same denominator, I can go ahead and just add. So we're gonna apply the same principle to these guys. So let's do it. So look what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead, I have x plus two and I have three. And then on the other side, I have x plus three. So I'm gonna multiply the top and the bottom by the same. I will do the same to the other side. Look at that, x plus two and then x plus two. Awesome. Now, look what's gonna happen. Since both denominators are the same, I can just go ahead and put just x plus three times x plus two. And now my top can go ahead and be worked up. So let's do it. This three times x, this is three times three, plus four times x, and then four times two. Be very careful. If you have a negative here, if you were subtracting instead of adding, that negative will affect every single term. But we have more examples on the website. Just let's concentrate on this. You have now the same denominator. We're gonna work out or we're gonna distribute the numbers. And look what you have. 3x plus nine plus 4x plus eight. Now I can group the ones that are the same which in this case I have 3x plus 4x and 9 plus 8. Awesome. So the next one is 7x plus 17 over x plus 3 times x plus 2. Beautiful. Look at this. My answer is right here. Thank you so much for doing such an amazing job. Please don't forget to watch our other videos. And also, thanks so much for learning.